brown, but who's no longer required to wear a wig, is here at the studios of Japan's public service broadcaster NHK, with a sibling like Prince Harry, who is happy to watch, but not participate. If I put one of these on, my brother will never let me forget it. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, you won't. Oh. <laughs> Spared brotherly humiliation, it fell to Tim Hitchens, Britain's ambassador to Japan, to serve Queen, country and a prince. William was encouraging from the sidelines. You've done this before, Abbas, you've been very calm and confident about this. <laughs> the man whose diplomatic career has covered Afghanistan, Kashmir and Africa has now taken a new turn. <laughs> Next stop for the wigless prince, the broadcaster's studio. This is where NHK film a popular drama series set in the 19th century. Having turned down the offer of a full head of hair, Prince William knew there was no escape when the costume department came calling. The man who will one day declare war and peace was ready for battle. Fantastic. I feel, uh, I feel ready for uh, action. I 